Your eyes don't catch light the way you imagine. They don't see waves, they don't see beams. They detect individual particles. In 1942, a scientist named Selig Hecht dropped an astonishing truth bomb. The human eye can detect as little as a single photon. One particle of light can set off vision. That puts our sight at the very edge of physics, the quantum limit. Deep in the retina, these rods, each a tiny biological photon detector, are so hypersensitive that a single quantum of light can fire a nerve signal to the brain. This isn't fantasy. This is solid experimental biology. Yet, there's another deeper shock. When a photon lands on the retina, that does not immediately turn into an image. In fact, there's some lag involved, about 80 to 100 milliseconds. How do you achieve immediate vision? You don't. Your brain is ahead of the light. It predicts reality before the light arrives. It edits the photons it receives. It erases the lag. It tames the chaos. According to the predictive processing theory, your brain isn't just responding to the world. It is constantly guessing at it. What you see is a controlled hallucination, guided by quantum particles. Even in complete darkness, your eyes remain active. In your photoreceptors, random quantum events set off spontaneous signals. This is dark noise. You're directly perceiving quantum signals in the absence of any external light whatsoever. Reality isn't perfectly clean. It's stitched together out of quantum randomness. And the ceiling of your vision isn't set by biology alone. It's set by quantum uncertainty itself. If your eyes were any more sensitive, the world would be overwhelmed by noise. So your brain walks a razor's edge. It sees everything and it sees nothing. You don't perceive the universe as it truly is. You perceive the universe after your brain filters quantum chaos into something usable. A photon arrives as raw probability and your brain turns it into color, shape, meaning, memory. Somewhere between the particle and your awareness, reality is invented. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more amazing science videos.